second time. All right. <laughs> Hi, it's Leslie, and we are going to try to do a comparison cooking. What, what do we call this? We're going to see if uh, store made protein balls or homemade protein balls, which is the better okay, protein yeah. ball. So we're talking we're making about balls. 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 Hollow <laughs> dollar dollar bills. So okay. at our favorite SIU place, Ariel got these protein balls and she says they're really good and on the label it says all the ingredients so we're thinking can we make it yeah so on pinterest i got us a recipe and we have all the ingredients ready and we are going to make them for you actually for us right now okay so who's gonna be like the person to dump it in um we might she's also need like a spoon for the honey and pepper, yeah but she's on she's on okay so it says, combine all the ingredients well with your hands in medium to large glass bowl. Good enough. It's okay. a bowl. It's good. Okay, so here's the ingredients. What's one, the first thing I need? One cup organic old-fashioned oats. Oats! It's Quaker, but we good. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Half cup organic peanut butter. Yeah, it's organic. Right? It's organic. It's skippy. <laughs> it's organic. Skippy. Mm. Skippy John Jones. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's like the it's like little turds. Hang it's on like there. peanut butter <laughs> slime. Okay, next. Hang on for dear life. We have half a cup organic ground flaxseed. That's this one. Ah! Oh. Oh. <laughs> so ringy, ding, dingy. Flaxseed. <sighs> Looks like mealworm mm. feed. Ew, mm. we're going to eat that. I'm Why just, are you going there? I'm just saying. Okay. Science so, life. Um, okay, next, half a cup organic chocolate chips. We just got mini semi-sweet chocolate got chips. Just little tiny They're the troll house for you. Okay, then a third cup organic raw honey. This actually is organic raw honey. That is one thing that I had that was organic. Oh, look at us. Oh, that looks good. This is satisfying. Mm. Wow. Look at all that. And as a tip, spray the containers with a little bit of uh, food lube before you try to put sticky stuff in. Like the nonstick cooking spray? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. That was so satisfying. And then one tablespoon organic chia seeds. Ch -ch -ch chia Here's what's funny about buying chia seeds. You get a lot at once. And so we bought them for this recipe. I have this whole bag of chia seeds for a tablespoon in this well, recipe. We'll just, if it tastes good, we'll make it again. Okay. So now it says... Ew. It says combine ingredients, mm. ingredients well with your hands. I have a spoon if you want to use that. But did you wash your hands? We nope. washed our hands. We did. Okay. But I um, think this is the case of too many cooks. So have fun. Oh yeah, it's all Ariel. Yeah, I'm going for it. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is nasty, y'all. Oh, you just mix it. There. How many balls do you think this is gonna make? I don't know. Do you think we're gonna have to do another batch? I think we're gonna have to add more peanut butter. I went heavy on the peanut butter, so yeah, well, you gotta mix it harder though. I gotta stand. Sorry. It's just good. It's good. This is special. It's sticking to my fingers. Okay, so keep keep make, make sure it's all mixed because you don't want any like dry oats. No, I okay. Kids My dad yeah. used to call oatmeal oats, and I always thought it sounded like what horses eat. I just say oatmeal, but apparently oats was right this whole it's time. It's stuck on my fingers. So scrape it off. This is like a whole three balls worth. That's not. Okay. <laughs> um, hold on. Okay, no, keep doing. Okay, it says... I'm getting... Those cover things. bowl and let chill in refrigerator for it's at least mixed. 30 Should minutes. Get in there? Here. It's so sticky. It's so yeah. Sweaty. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, it's so Ooh, it smells good. Yeah, it smells it's wonderful. It's very peanut buttery. <sighs> this smells so delicious. It's exfoliating. Yeah. Don't say that. What? We're eating this. It's going to exfoliate my skin. That's what I'm saying. It's I not a pumpkin. That. I had a pumpkin exfoliate when we got our facials. Okay, what I'm saying is you're saying this exfoliates your skin as you're peeling it off your skin for us to eat. Enjoy. Oh, my God. <laughs> I think, actually, it's pretty mixed. Okay, so now we need to cover it and let it sleep for 30 minutes in the fridge. 
99. All right. Nine, nine. So Teresa's on that. But I'll wash my hands. So we are going to come back in 30 minutes and oh, good. finish this up. So far, so good? Yeah. All right. So Ariel's going to snack on her hands. And okay. Go. We're back. It's been 30 minutes at least. And now it says, once chilled, roll into balls of whatever size you would like. We're going to use these things. Um, do you know what size you would like? I like to make them and then freeze them in a large glass container. Apparently this Pinterest person likes to do that. Get it, um, Pinterest. Okay. It says makes about 25 to 30 balls. I, um, tiny balls. Hold that next to that. Like, no. Uh, no. Okay. Tiny so balls. we want to make these like the ones we bought. So we're going to roll some of them in coconut because the other ones are covered in coconut. So what I would do is, I, yeah, portion it, put it in my hand. I'm gonna Shave roll. It a little bit. It's gonna be a ball. And I'm gonna let it happen in here. Oh, sprinkler. Oh, I'm spitting it. I'm gonna spit in this. This would have contaminated all of it. Sorry. And then yeah. it'd all be Ariel's. That's really cheap. Okay. <laughs> Does that look pretty? It looks covered. Good enough. Oh, that's okay. Good. I don't want uh, any. Give me another one. Oh, sorry. We're only gonna make like. Sorry. Sorry. Shape it. Okay. Put it on my hand. Okay. So some of them will have coconut and some will not. I'm only making like three with the coconut. Yeah. Because that's all we need for our taste test. And then, here, throw it in. Okay, so now you guys can just roll them instead of one thing. Okay. And then these are probably better if you store them refrigerated so they don't like melt. These are gonna be so good. Right, well, how did they your smell? They tasted good. So. They smell so wonderful. I just smell honey. I smell peanut butter. Yeah. Honey. Peanut butter and honey. And then there's like those little chocolate chips in there. So it should it's be. Just it's going to be amazing. Tasty. Coconut is not sticking very well. I think I'm missing a step. But that's fine. Press it. Oh, but then it's not as cylindery. Okay. I'm really trying to make this look more coconutty. Okay. Eh, good enough? Okay. These so are tiny than the ones they have. They are. But that'll good. still do. I think they'd be easier to store. In Sorry. Our, in our glass freezer thing. Yeah, in mm -hmm. our glass. Or to take it to work, I put a little container. tiny Tupperware. What did I put? My protein ball. Protein ball. So instead of like, you know, eating half a one, you can eat one and bring two. You see what I'm saying? Boom. Okay. Okay. So we have on our plate one of the ones we made. And then we have three of these balls, store bought, that we got. They're not really store bought. They're locally made, but right. I'm sure we paid more for them than. They're huge, is what. Yeah. So like, look at this difference. Like. They look okay. the same on the camera. No. Oh wait, you could tell. There you go. Like one. Wow. So well, yeah. From can... them, it's yeah, this see. big. From us. Look at that. Okay. Yeah. But I'm okay with that. Okay. So. To me, this is like. This is a more manageable size though. I think so too. Like I'd rather eat two little balls than one big ball. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's what she said. Shut up. Okay, so <laughs> which one are we, do we want to try what we're comparing it to first? Sure. Yeah, let's try this big old ball. I right. actually have not tried this. All right, cheers. Dink it. it. Dink it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's do it. They're really hard. Mm. That's so good. Really coconutty. Yeah. It is. I predict there's coconut throughout this, but that's okay. Yeah. I've actually never tried these before. That, Ariel the, did, and she said they were good. The so. ones I buy don't have coconut uh, around them, just inside of them. Yeah. So I was like, what? <clears throat> okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, there was some around that so good. Okay. Okay. Are you ready for the, All right. the homemade one? Yeah. Okay, cheers. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Mmm. More flavors are in on my on this one. I feel like ours is more peanut buttery. Yeah, ours is a lot of peanut butter and honey, which I like. Mm, yeah. I'm just a lot of it. I would add the vanilla on the second batch. Okay. Um Yeah, the recipe called for vanilla, but our ingredients didn't have it on there, so we just didn't do it. Hmm. This is a lot of coconut. Like I like coconut, but this is like, this is chocolate block coconut. 
The insides like, look like the same though. They yeah. did a pretty good job. Yeah. I don't know. The same. I think I like ours. I like what our amount of honey. Mm-hmm. I like them both a lot, and if we can make it and pre-make them, I'm sure it would be more cost-efficient and we're not wasting plastic containers in the world. I'm okay with that. Yeah. All right, so we feel like we can make these? Yeah. Totally. All right, we're going to make some more. It's a win. Yeah. Bye. Bye.